Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. So today I'm actually going to be showing you guys how to get this look. This look is kind of Valentine's Day appropriate if you're really extra and your boyfriend um, kind of lets you. I would do this because I know my boyfriend would let me wear this, but he's not here. So I'm not doing anything on Valentine's Day other than just laying around, which is the best thing you can possibly do because everywhere is probably packed. Um, but... I kind of wanted to do this look that I did on my Instagram. If you guys don't have me on Instagram, it's Makeup by April with double L's. Um, I kind of wanted to do the same thing, but I just did not add black because I felt like that black just made it so smoky and did it so like so sultry. And I kind of wanted to do kind of a colorful look, so I kind of did do a colorful look here. Um, I really, really like it. If you guys don't wonder why, I keep looking at the view viewfinder so I could. Um, see myself and see how I'm focused and whatever but other than that guys if you guys want to know how to achieve this look then go ahead and keep watching so I'm going to use the Morphe 35B palette for this look um super colorful I wanted to do something colorful today and if you guys see me keep looking over here I have my monitor over here so it's kind of something new to me because I really don't use this monitor type of Thing, but I wanted to try something different. And if you guys hear noise, just know there's construction going on. So I'm gonna, uh, I'm gonna start off with this pink look. This pink eyeshadow. Right here. There's construction going on. Okay, just, just disregard that. I'm gonna do a look I did for my Instagram. I really, really, really liked it. So I don't know if you guys could see, but I'm just gonna go in. Not bring it up too much in right here, but basically, just, just circular motions. Trying to do here. So this whole look is gonna be used with this palette. The only we're gonna use one shadow that isn't from this palette, which is in the Jaclyn Hill palette. But other than that, everything, every color is used. On this palette so go into this purple shade right here and basically put it lower not too much where the pink is I want to have the pink kind of peeking out when we do this uh, look so basically right below it and with this shade you basically have to intensify it intensify and build it up the color so it's pretty much what we're doing can you guys see that see we kind of have a little bit of pink peeking up here right here so that's kind of what we want and then we'll blend it out in a little bit well, but we're just pretty much just building it right here and I'm gonna go in back with this BH the number faded away but it's a BH brush and then just blending it and the same thing like I said and do it until you are satisfied with the color I am actually gonna build it up a little more I'll be right back. Okay, so basically I did the middles because I want to do a halo eye. And I'm not going to do the exact same like I did on my Instagram because um, I kind of just didn't want to go for that look again. But if you guys want to and you know if you know what I'm talking about, go ahead and let me know and I will film it for you guys. But I'm going to go in with the light purple first, this one right here. And then I'm kind of going to make that into like kind of faded into so it can look blend it out and it can look like a halo eye that's what we're trying to achieve here <laughs> so i kind of like to go in for like light and then i go darker um for that
just so you won't see that harsh line and you guys can kind of see it's kind of hugging but there is darker so it kind of still looks harsh we're gonna go into that purple shade and then go ahead we're going for and then i'm gonna go into the dark purple that we used up here and do the same thing So I'm going to take this um, right here and basically put it on top a little bit up here so it can have like shadow and it can look stand out. Okay. You're going to put that in your video? Mm -hmm. Hello. <laughs> I'm using this one right here from the Jaclyn Hill palette. It's so dirty on that. Oh my god. Putting it in the middle. Ah, my nose itches. Take the white eyeliner and basically put it up here on the top. So it can look like a halo eye. Yeah, I keep looking over here. What? Oh, that looks like shit. Huh? Um, right there. Because I kind of don't like the white eyeliner. So I'm just going to like cover it kind of. I'm using the Dodo Lashes in D115. I will leave my coupon code below. So for foundation, I'm going to be using the Urban Decay All Nighter Foundation in 6.5 and the Maybelline Full Coverage Foundation in... 310 sun beige so i'm gonna mix these together because they're super full coverage and i'm just gonna apply it on my face these foundations are like legit the same the only difference is the all-nighter is more like a look it's like super thick um the all-nighter is more um like has more of a pink tone and I'm gonna use my sponge. My sponge is super dirty, but just disregard that. Um, it just takes everything away. You guys, all of those like things that it was just scars. So yeah. Um, make sure whatever you have left, put it down your neck you don't want too much like you can see the difference and all that so i'm going to use the tarte shape take in light medium honey and i like this little trick oh i forgot to show you guys this little trick where even though this is very damp i like to take some setting spray um and then blend it out like that. I saw Jaclyn Hill do that. And it just blends it so seamlessly amazing. So guys, how do you feel about Stormy? Um, if you guys don't know who Stormy is, that is Kylie Jenner's baby girl. Um, I'm not crazy about the name. I don't I'm not like, oh my god, you know. Um it's okay i guess um i guess i'm mexican <laughs> and like that is extremely weird to us but whatever it's their kid not mine 
so you guys see the difference like with it like the concealer just pretty much brightened up my eye a lot and i feel like a lot of people don't realize what so i like to contour my nose guys and what i've noticed is to bring the con the the concealer where you want it and just bring it down like that and it automatically contours your nose i don't know if you guys can see that right here but i like that a shadow so you look like you actually have cheekbones and i do have cheekbones which i was very much blessed with by my grandmother because my grandmother has amazing cheekbones like amazing like she could have just given them to me it would have been awesome I, w I would love to have done her makeup when she was here but i didn't know how to do makeup then palette and i'm gonna take these two shades to bronze up my face and basically bring color back onto my face so just the contouring right there so it basically brings a lot of color back into my face because um with the setting powder it kind of gives it a little bit of a flashy flashy back what flashback for blush i'm going to be using this stella blush right here look at that it's so pretty and i'm basically taking this brush right here and what i like to do i like to tap it in So I'm not done yet, but I'm going to go ahead and put lip gloss on. This is the Fenty lip gloss in Fenty Glow. It's a super pretty gloss. So I'm going to put setting spray. I definitely forgot to mention that, but... Thank you guys so much for watching my video i really 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 hope you guys enjoyed it oh my god i'm so sick i'm like trying to keep it together because like my nose is so freaking congested right now it's getting me mad and this shirt doesn't want to look good okay there so yeah i really just hope you guys enjoyed it i really like this look i'm actually at one more video to upload which is something a soft soft valentine's day look and um yeah because i know not a lot of people like to go all out for valentine's day and i am one that likes to go all out so that is why i have two videos that are all out for my extra people but if you, of course if you don't i do have a video up going up for you in a couple of days in about two days because i'm trying to upload twice a week because I really want to keep the content out there, guys. So, um, yeah, guys, I'm very sick right now. That's why I didn't upload last week because I was worse. And right now I'm, like, really bad, but I was worse last week. So, <sighs> <coughs> um, make sure to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Make sure to hit my notification bell so you guys can be notified every time I upload. Like this video. It, like, thumbs up this video if you guys liked it. And I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye, guys.